How are you? Hi there. Nice to meet you. So tell me what brought you out tonight? Why do you want to celebrate a night of jazz and comedy with Bill Cosby and of course the hundredth anniversary or yeah, birthday of the Beverly Hills Hotel? Two reasons. There was a Vanity Fair article recently about uh, the history of the Beverly Hills Hotel and I thought we really need to hang out there more <laughs> because I want to have an affair with like Joan Collins or something. Uh, and then secondly, it's Bill Cosby playing jazz. I mean, what kind of idiot doesn't want to come and see that? Now, you're, you're a comedian also, so was Bill someone who you looked up to when you were sort of starting in comedy? And how, how does his, his comedy sort of affect your life? Um, uh, he doesn't. He has such a <laughs> unique Bill Cosby brand of comedy. I don't think I could have possibly mimicked him. That would have right. come across as very weird. But, um, <laughs> you know, uh, lots of great comedians obviously came up through learning his routines and copying him. I think Chris Rock's very open about having memorized all his stuff and Eddie Murphy. So, I mean, he's clearly influenced uh, many of my favorites as well as being one of my favorites himself. What, is your, what was your like favorite or best memory of Bill and his comedy? If you have one. I don't have one. <laughs> like that's yeah. <laughs> yeah, yeah. And any I know projects? I was going to have to think that hard. <laughs> Come in here. Any new projects? Yes, hit, hit and run that? August 24th with the lovely Kristen Bell. Tell us a little bit about it's a car chase movie. Okay. Comedy. <laughs> Kristen Bell and I play um, on-screen fictitious lovers, and in real life, of course, we are real-life lovers. <laughs> and, uh, yeah, it's got a bunch of great people in it. Uh, Bradley Cooper and Kristen Chenoweth and um, Tom Arnold and Michael Rosenbaum. So it's uh, it's just a really great, fun ensemble car chase comedy. Well, thank you very much. Yeah.